first stop of the 2020 season took us north of the border as we rolled into Driftland for a long overdue kickoff to the championship. Pro 2 wildcard driver David Goldstraw wowed the judges as he debuted with a solid 94 point run, earning him the top spot in qualifying. Can he keep him all the way going, all the way to the wall? Oh, a little wobble, yeah. but he makes it out to Very the wall. Nice. Simon Perry say a 95 from Simon Perry and look at that a 94 he jumps into first place does David Goldstraw the Lucas Oil Hard Charger award was taken home by Tom Van Beek he demonstrated some incredible skill as he piloted the lowest powered car on the grid Driftland local Wee Stu would take the third step of the podium. His aggressive driving style combined with his in and out knowledge of the circuit meant he was a real threat all weekend. He took the win after Irish competitor Dylan Kehoe's clutch failed, meaning he bowed out of the playoff battle. The final battle of the day would see Sheffield's 15 year old wonder kid Max Cotton stick his LS swap PS on the door of first place qualifier David Goldstraw. It was a tense matchup and both drivers ran incredible lines but the proximity from Max saw him clench the win. Next up we stopped off at Three Sisters Circuit, a fan favourite venue with a tight and technical layout. We also had the cannon run in the house, showing off some of the most ridiculous supercars you could ever imagine. The Lucas Oil hard charger went to Mark Brown. He had his V8 swapped in Pretzer dialed in and look comfortable getting all the way to the 4th position finish. Danny Maguire finished in 3rd and earned his first BDC podium. He looked to have bonded with his new VR38 engine Sylvia as he put on a massive show for his home crowd. In the final, Max and Dylan Kehoe would slug it out in an amazing show of talent from two young up and coming drivers. The matchup was close, but Max would come away with his second overall victory. Our run of good weather ran out at Teesside for round three and what would end up as the last round of the year. With terrible conditions and a brand new layout, the drivers faced many challenges and uncertainties. That didn't stop Lucas Oil Hard Charger Award winner Johan Quizies from pushing the limits in his 2JZ E46. He had a point to prove and took home a trophy for his effort. Spot will be taken by 
Dylan Kehoe after he took down Wee Stu in another close call matchup. Things got even more wild and moving into the final when wet weather specialist Charlie Hoover went up against Irish talent Sean Devine. The matchup was so tight it even went one more time and Sean walked away with the victory. That was the Pro 2 recap for 2020. We saw some amazing talent enter the championship because of the permit scheme, the presentation of the cars and the level of the driving was pushed further than ever before. Make sure you check back again soon for the pro recap that's coming next.